All right, Tina's like everybody else here. She loves to be videoed by Doc Positive. But Pikachu here, he don't care. Pikachu! The reason we're here with Pikachu is... Pikachu is Cryptorchid. So we're just now explaining to mom what Cryptorchid means. And simply broken down, Crypt means hidden and Orchid is testicle. So Pikachu is a seven-month-old Morky, that's a Maltese combined with a Yorkie, and he's a seven-month-old Morky with an undescended testicle. One of his testicles did not make the full trip down into his scrotum. So we'll have more to follow, and we'll explain to you the dynamics of cryptorchidism and what that means in the long run for Pikachu. But for now, Pikachu's soaking up the attention of Tina here, and Tina's soaking up the attention... Uh, She's going to be a, a YouTube star. Bye now. Oh, it's usually going <laughs> All right. We're here with Doc Positive today, East Stroudsburg Veterinary Hospital, talking about cryptorchidism in male dogs. Cryptorchidism is simply an undescended testicle. Uh, in puppies, as they're developing inside mom, inside her uterus, the testicles start their development uh, much the same place near the kidneys as uh, female puppies, where the ovaries do. And as puppies develop embryologically, those testicles start to migrate down through the abdomen. And at or about the time puppies are born, those testicles pop through a ring called the inguinal ring in the abdomen and drop into the testicle. And cryptorganism is literally, crypt means hidden, uh, orchid is testicle, and so cryptorchid is a hidden testicle. And the reason it's hidden is because it hasn't made the whole trip from up near the kidneys into the scrotum. Uh, and this is typically a problem in toy breed dogs. And by toy breed dogs, your Yorkies, your Chihuahuas, your Maltese, Pomeranians, and small dogs. Uh, and it also tends to be a congenital problem. It is very heritable. It is passed from the male dog to his puppies. And as such, uh, these dogs should not be bred. The majority of dogs should not be bred anyhow. The majority of dogs should be neutered, but particularly when they have a gene for cryptorchidism because they'll pass that on to their uh, puppies and then their puppies, and it just perpetuates this problem of cryptorchidism or a hidden testicle. The big reason, though, is because testicles are meant to be maintained at lower than body temperature. And that's why the scrotum hangs below the body Testicles are meant to be cooler than body temperature uh, in order for uh, sperm survival. But also, a undescended testicle uh, inside the abdomen being kept at a uh, higher than normal temperature is much more likely to develop cancer in the long run. Uh, certain studies have shown that certain types of testicular cancers 50% of Sertoli cell tumors, which is a type of testicular cancer, cancer are found in undescended testicles. So it's a really, really imperative to get dogs with an undescended testicle uh, neutered. Uh, sometimes the testicle will make part of the trip down and just not pop into the scrotum itself. And in a small percentage of dogs, those testicles can be found on the outside of the body wall, not intra-abdominally. And that makes a big difference surgically. Because uh, a male dog that has a completely undescended testicle, an intra-abdominal testicle, it's almost like doing a uh, canine spay on that side. Because you're going into the abdomen to remove that testicle. So. Just want to give you a little information. We just saw Pikachu for uh, an undescended testicle. The people were planning on using him for breeding purposes. 
Daf positive, uh, explain to them the reasons for not breeding that dog, uh, the reasons to go ahead and neuter him, and I wanted to share this information with those of you following uh, Doc Positive in the East Strasburg Veterinary Hospital. And uh, it's just interesting, um, interesting stuff. So a little bit on cryptorchidism or undescended testicles in dogs. Bye now.